Welcome back. We are us and this. This is Itarina Noctis. So, I have made my way up to the Oracle Sanctuary or Tower or some other term. I don't know where I actually am, but I'm up here. I went to, whew, it was so awful. I went to the, um, ugh, what's the name of that freaking place? The Infinite Bay. No, see, it's saying C again. I went to the Infinite C. I had to turn down all of the game's settings just to get it to run decently. Like, I even had to reduce the resolution to as low as it would go. Which wasn't fun, but I managed to get all the way up without falling back down because I would have absolutely lost it. So I did that on my own time, took care of that, and managed to get all the way back here. So, this place has an interesting mechanic, which will never be seen again once we leave this place, and I'm okay with that. See, what happens here is, you see how this place is structured? It's a lie. So just so we're clear, this is an actual wall of spikes. Now I came in here before last night and as soon as I saw it, I figured this would probably turn into violence. I didn't see the lamp there before, but I wouldn't have touched it anyway. I would have just closed the game like I did. Right, the whole thing where nothing is like it appears. Enemies are invisible. And it explodes and reverses my controls. I don't like this place. not doing any damage? Oh, crap. It really won't let me do... It really won't let me do damage unless they're visible. Oh, I hate this. This isn't even a platform. Okay. So there are one, two, three enemies here. At least with telltale... Telltale... Indications of their existence. Hey, a throne. At least... Yeah, this is what I was... These things are real. Yeah, 
it wouldn't let me double jump. Now, we don't have to worry about how we'll get back up here if I encounter something I can't get past. That's not real. That's not real. That way it is. Ooh. And I died anyway. had to give them a reverse control mechanic. No nope, gimmick, that's the term. Wait, so this one isn't even real, but this one is not either. What the frick? What? stand here and wait. At the very least, oh, what? At the very least, I am glad that I don't have to deal with enemies who or at least the slime enemies who deal damage to you in some way. But with the... with the reverse controls gimmick, I... I'm not happy. This is the, this is the mechanism that, <clears throat> this is the mechanism that opens the Oracle Chamber, same as last time. So I need to collect, right, I need to collect three eye things before I can go and talk to the Oracle, who I guess that's what we want to do. Well, that is terribly unpleasant. Frankly, the fact that there's nothing happening is terrifying. Usually these flex here mean that there's something to be revealed by the arrow, but I guess not in this case. So I did revert the game's uh, wonderful. That's why. Nope. I don't know what's going on there, but I'm leaving. You may or may not have noticed previously.
Yeah, I don't like this. So I have to find my way through this room before I just get gived. Huh? I have to be honest, I'm already looking for this session to be over. So it loses track of me in the illusions. Even if I clear them with this. Well, that makes dealing with this place a little less awful. I have to be honest. God, this was down here. We almost died. So, when we're dealing with these slimes, there's going to be quite a bit of just standing around waiting for... Well, waiting for the, um... I want a better word than reverse control effect. Let's call it confusion. From now on. So when we're dealing with the slimes, there's going to be a lot of just standing around waiting for the confusion to wear off. Quite a bit of just standing. Let's do it this way. So, how have you guys been doing? Have you been looking forward to this nonsense? To be honest, I want to see everything. <sighs> what? Oh, I thought those were legs.
entire wall over there is false. No. I want the thumbnail for this video to be this room. Probably something like this, but not as difficult to see, you know? This would be impossible to turn into a thumbnail because you can't see the character, so you don't know what you're supposed to be focusing on. But this is also bad, even with the arrow here like this revealing me, because you can't see the eye at the top that's part of the gimmick of the room. That's a real wall. Nope, stop looking at me. Oh, boy. Surely there's something great up here for making it through. I see how this goes. Also, the performance is pretty bad in here. Interesting. this sent me. Ah, okay. I skipped the entire early part of that side to the left. Since the arrow just traveled the entire way back here. Um, I may have missed something of interest back there, but... But I mean, unless it's a new power or a skill point. Thank you. So there's just a mirror fragment chilling out over there? What's the catch? Besides the obvious. turn down the resolution to be able to play this. I'm not <clears throat> I'm not adding any effects or yeah, any effects during editing to make these arrows glow like this. That's not me. That's entirely the game. And as a result of that 
the game is performing poorly. So that's the first eye I need then. But I also need to hit this thing. How the frick am I supposed to do that? Feels like I'm missing something here. Oh, dang it. I'd have to put it here then. we do this <clears throat> if I have an arrow stuck in that thing no I have to, I just have to move faster so I put an arrow here fire fire another one through the portal Hit the teleport down fire. So I'd have to swap the arrow immediately after firing. And then teleport to it. No, we missed this step. goes so fast. God dang it. That's... That's what I was worried about. I have to <sighs> I put this arrow in the ceiling send another one through teleport to it no it doesn't work I need one set in the in the wall that's going to be going up but I need one in this thing so I can teleport to it, but if it's in the center of it, 
and the thing retracts entirely, the arrow doesn't just sit there, it travels with it. I need to be here. But I can't... I can't use the teleport trick like that. Oh, I see what the problem is. I'm shooting this too soon, and then trying to travel this entire length, then fire an arrow that way. So what I need to do... When I hit this thing up here and teleport to the arrow here, I need to run back to this, then fire the gold arrow, or arrow of light, then drop down here and fire the next one. The math checks out, but can we pull it off? Wow, that does not last a long time. Unfortunate. When I fire that arrow through, I have to move forward. Otherwise, I can't teleport to it because it's too far away. <sighs> I like puzzles like that. This is one of the Oracle's eyes. I mean, we may as well. Why not? And so, ladies and gentlemen, I think that's where we're going to leave off for today. I wanted to keep these closer to 30 minutes, but in the past few, especially down there in the Undersea Fortress, if that's what it's supposed to be called, have been a bit of a... What do you call it? There's just been a lot of backtracking there, not a lot of forward progress, so I've made those videos longer, but I've wanted them to go back to being 30 minutes, so here we are. The next video for this won't be until if I if today is actually Thursday, then the next video won't be until Tuesday. So, it's going to be a bit of a wait before we see what happens next, but there is still a lot to this map. We still also haven't found the guy that, that sells the area map so I know where I've been and where I haven't. None of these places are too awful to ex explore, so backtracking won't be as detrimental or feel as awful as it does in the Undersea Fortress. We're just going through a single room is torture. So, we're going to stay here and try and get this place knocked out. And, I hope you guys are looking forward to that. In addition, I've also, I also hope that you've enjoyed everything you've seen here today. Again, just so you don't forget, we will have another episode on Tuesday. So, if anything here has caught your interest, be sure to come and check it out then. And so, with all that said, we will see you next time. Get it?
Thank you.